Now we are playing more Hogwarts Legacy. I believe this is part four of our playthrough. What adventures will behold us today? We may never know. Paperclip bypasses all security. What do you mean by like security though? On the switch. You only had one 360 red ring on you? Yeah, I had one too. That's all I, I had. My original one got the red rings. I fixed it once and then it did it again and then it never worked after that. Then I bought one of the newer models and it hasn't red ringed on me. It has shut off at random. With red lights, so that's only because the hard drive keeps coming loose sometimes. Like it's very random, the hard drive will just, they don't even move the thing. And then it'll just randomly have a hard drive loose and I just reinsert it and usually it's good to go but as far as like reading games my 360 has been great with the reading games it has frozen a few times I wonder if that's just like overheating now even though I don't think it should be overheating but it's just old you know it has a lot of miles on it right, where are we going right now There's red arrows over here. You're dead. I want their stuff. There we go. I want to save the beast, but apparently I can't yet. Oh, that's a big and well potion. Rebellion. You hate how the 360s are bought. Yeah, the original models were bad. Like, like I don't know how they... Like when systems come out a lot of the time, they aren't their best selves, are they? I know they need like time to grow and fix their issues and come with other models, but man, do they like test them enough sometimes? I wonder if they actually have people like, if I were making a system, I would want to test it like, like crazy before I released it. Make sure everything is running right and like make sure there's no overheating issues. Like I'm talking like have somebody play them for like, Days straight to make sure there's nothing. There we go, we did that. Little task. Dock wizards. You gonna tell me? Come on, you can't get over this. Oh my gosh. Yeah. They get really hot. Yeah, the old 360s would overheat too, I think. Each disk drive is only exclusive to that system, really. I didn't know that. Your 360 had a disc suck somewhere in it and they said to stand it up. But you shouldn't do that. Like, you can stand up your 360 if there's nothing stuck in it, but if there's a disc stuck in there, maybe. My, uh, I've never had a disc get stuck in my 360. Sometimes the door on, the, on it doesn't open all the, like, on the first try. I gotta like, press the button a few times to get it to work. I've had I've had games get stuck in my Xbox One, which is awful. I've used like manual ejections and it like I literally had to fish State of K two out of my Xbox One twice with a a, a a gift card 
and a pair of tweezers because I needed like something really thin, a small pair of tweezers and a gift card that I could slide in to kind of lift it up because I had nothing else thin enough that was like thick enough that would create enough force to, to get it out of there. And it scratched it up a little bit. It's still, I mean, it works. The game works still on my Series X, but I'm never putting it in my Xbox One, this this one ever again, anyways. So I like I just uh, I, I don't put games in my Xbox One anymore. If I want to play an Xbox One game, unfortunately now I have to install it into my Series X until I can get another one or get that one fixed. My games literally get stuck in there. They don't read them. It stopped reading everything, and the games would just get stuck. To the point where I can't almost can't get him out without like damaging everything. It was because of lower quality solder soldering that was in there. Interesting. Oh yeah yeah. Oh if you have a disc running in your 360, yeah, you don't want to move it at all, yeah. You don't want to bump it. Yeah, I think I think one of my, uh, my my games got ruined because of that once. It didn't get stuck in there, but it like scratched it up and it didn't work anymore. Here's the uh, Quidditch Stadium. Yeah, so if you have a game running in your 360, do not move it at all. Eject it first. I don't don't try to move it. I tend not to move any of my disk systems when they have a game in there, unless it's like already stuck, then I'm like, if I have to turn it like a certain way, that might help maybe, but I try not to move it. I'm gonna go on an adventure. The King Kong movie game was the one that got stuck. That's, that's random. I have that game actually. <laughs> I have it on the PS2. I haven't played it. It lo looks really cool, though. Honestly, like... It looks like a very cinematic type of game. Heard it's, uh, heard it's actually pretty decent. For a licensed game. Look at this beautiful view, view man. This is... So beautiful you can taste it. I want to go to that tree over there, if I can. Did we already come? Did we come past here already? I don't know. I don't think we went to this tree, did we? Jabernol. No. Uh oh, did I like kill this poor thing? I wonder if I have to get them in the cage? No, I'm just I'm just annoying them, I think. I'm like, why would I be putting them in a cage? The cage is all over. This is a really nice little spot. You like that game? No complaints about it. I just found out that King Kong game is expensive now. How much does it go for? BC? Oh, for about 50. Oh, wow. Yeah, I got it. I think I got it for $2. I found it in a thrift store. Hey, welcome in, Amara Dave. Nice to see you, man. I hope you're doing good. Hello, hello. Crazy price jumps. Yeah, it's with like every retro game now. We just looked at the freaking Razor Scooter game. It's like 20 bucks now for whatever reason. It's insane. Some games have gone down. I've seen some games go down, which is surprising. But then other games just go up. And it's like, what? It's just ever fluctuating now. Mostly going up. Look how glorious. I mean. Living our life in this game, aren't we? We're living our life in Hogwarts. 
I want to get back down there. If I do this, I'm getting myself killed. Oh. to the bridge. Right, are there any like quests that we want to do right now? Right, these are two these are two main things. We have the Professor Hackett's uh, excitement too that maybe we could do that. And there's the uh, the dolly and keys. We found four of those so far. That stuff we'll just look for as we come across it. Um, I guess we could do that one tonight, too. Like I said, I'm going to take my time with all the main stuff. Uh, we'll explore the land as the seasons change, too. And I said, we'll just. I'm going to keep. I'm gonna, as I've said on one of previous episodes, I'm going to keep this playthrough pretty open ended so that, you know, we can kind of just wrap it up on our own terms whenever. Like, if I'm still playing this game in, like, November, like, so be it. Even if I take, like, a long break from it. Maybe they're stuck inside people's Xbox 360s and they became rare. Everyone's got those, those King Kong games stuck in there. Have I given a summary on your completed quests? My completed quests, you'd like to see those. What have we? We've done a lot of them, I think. These are all completed. So these are some uh, side ones. And all these yellow ones are some main ones that we've done. Already. The restrict restricted uh, section was one of the last ones we did. And we've crossed one spell combination practice we've done. We're still working on the Professor Hecate's assignments. Yeah, these are all the ones. So we've completed quite a bit of quests, despite all the exploring we've done. Side relationship assignments. So I think what we'll try to do this episode is someone another one of these assignment ones too. Got our gear. Ah, spiffy. Conjurations you have learned. So we can like. Decorations the gameplay stations conjured in the room of requirement. Wait, we can like decorate it? Hang on. Is this stuff all because obviously we're conjuring them up. So we can like decorate a place? What? This game has another awesome gameplay element to it that we still haven't even got into. These are all the enemy types we've seen so far. Yeah, no problem, Dave. No problem. You need to get back to this game. Still at 50%. Yeah, there's just endless stuff you can do and endless fun in this game, man. I'm going to be playing so much of this, I think. Like, incredible. I might try to, like, 100% this game. If that's possible. Even Like, if I'm able to make all the missions. Like, eventually try to 100% it if it's possible. If not, you know, whatever. But... So if there's like time missions that I don't get in on, that might screw us. So the room requirement has great customization and it's part of the main quest. Oh wow, that's so awesome. Look at all these enemy types we've still yet to see. What do we have unlocked the most down here? I guess these ingredients. We've collected a lot of ingredients. We 
We have rescuable beasts like this one. We still don't know how to get the beasts. Um, we found a couple out there in the wild. What is this? Oh, Revelio pages. We're 45. I love the way this is set up here so we can see where we got some of these pages and how many more you need for that area. Hogwarts. And the castle has so many, doesn't it? The Highlands. All the ones out there. Appearances I have collected. 17 of 79. See, room requirement 0%, that's why. I don't know what the exploration tab is. Don't know when that will go up. All right. So awesome. Gotta love it. Just enjoying a nice night in Hogwarts. When we're ready, we'll go do the assignment. Can't even do it right this second, anyways, unless we rest or wait till the morning. There's probably more chests we can get here too. Now that we have the, in, um, we have this spell. So we can't do the lock picking. Yeah, another lock pick. Can you climb this? Stuff back there. And once we get in there, there's like a lot of treasures to be had. Another one up there. Yeah, no problem, Dave. No problem. And you like how you just wait for a quest. You just sit on the ground for hours until the quest giver comes back. As a patient student, yeah, you're like, all right, I'll just tell him way here. <laughs> what are you doing out so late, huh? Up to no good, I presume. You can see there's more of those eyeball chests too. Oh wait. Oh wait, wait, wait. This is one of the uh, the keys. Follow that thing. Follow that. Yeah, here we go. token. Five of them now. Rebellion. That's the last 
idea that I don't write down. Let's keep going here. Slapping fly keys. Yeah, me. That's one of the main things, right? So it's cool to see some of the students up late, you know, it's like she's just over here like reading something like There's a chest over here. It's probably way up or below. Nelly. Could you remind me how the Dedalian keys work again? It's Nelly. When you spot or hear a flying key, you're to follow it back to its cabinet. Inserting it in the lock is the tricky part. I hope you follow some. If you open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. I've opened plenty, but I'll never tell. Ooh, uh, oh wait, this is another mission here. So there's like side missions. Should I just like actually wait here till it's time? She's already in here. Professor, I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House, like you. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. Levitating the cats. I pet them, you just send them in the air. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying huh. a sugar quill during a lecture. No. Oh. I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. How um, fascinating. Time itself. I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. It's Suffice unspeakable, it say, you say? The job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Yeah, Keep thank up you. with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside Tch. and outside. We're always outside. prepared for mischief. Are we not? All right, let's let's do this now. Wait. Yeah. You could say we showed up early for class. Musical montage. Is that Sebastian over there? Everybody seems so happy.
Where y'all going? Don't leave me here, peeps. Pupils. You aren't leaving. <laughs> um, I want to make sure that they're late to their next class. That's right. He just gave up. Now you're gonna leave? There you go. You're allowed to leave now. There you go. We may or may not be a bully. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Oh, here we go. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. Spelliamus. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay and practice. I will. I uh, oops, pressed the wrong thing. Now let's get rid of uh let's, where is Expelliarmus? Right here. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right stick. The king of the Nice, all right. I didn't realize we were pretty much already done with that quest. So. <laughs> we always seem to end up in this fancy area every episode. Not on purpose, usually. Spare just... a moment. I could use your help. What is this? Duncan. Duncan Hobhouse. You wanted to speak with me? I did. Hello, I'm Duncan Hobhouse. Pleasure to meet you. I've heard all about you, of course. Confronting trolls and dragons. I suppose it must seem that way. I'm not sure it's justified. It's often been a matter of circumstance. I'm going to presume your reputation is in fact warranted. In which case, you are precisely the person I need. You see, uh -oh. we were learning to repel boggarts in Professor Hackett's class. And, well, mine unfortunately took the shape of a, a puff scheme. Are you afraid of your own shadow too? Surely you're joking. Can't possibly be afraid of the Pupsky. It may seem irrational to you, but my experience with them has been most upsetting. They eat bogeys, you know. Regardless of how reasonable I believe my fear of Pupsky is to be, I'm beginning to get a reputation as a coward. Some have even taken to calling me Pupsky Dunkeen. <laughs> that's actually funny. Uh, I'm sorry, but you have to admit that's rather clever. I do not have to admit that. <laughs> Never have said the same thing. Anyway, to make matters worse, I stupidly blurted out that I must be braver than people think, since I have been in the Hidden Herbology Corridor. The Hidden Herbology Corridor? Yes. Rumor has it that the Herbology Professor before Professor Garlic kept dangerous plants there. It's supposedly so overrun now that no one dares enter it anymore. I was hoping you could go there and bring back evidence that I could use to show that... Well, I'd gone in. Wow. Say a bit of an exceptionally dangerous plant of some kind. Very well. If I'm in the area, perhaps I shall take a look. Grand. I'd very much appreciate it. Okay. Come and find me if you get the proof. We're going to go on a nice little dead. trip to the greenhouse. Um, I should probably... Make this one, right? Almost. 
Okay, so there's evil plants that are only affected by that. Sounds intriguing. And this is, uh, it's Nelly again. Could you remind me how oh. to dig in Key's work? When you spot no, key I already know. Buying key, you're to follow, I hope you follow some. If you open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find. I didn't know she was going to say the same thing again. <sighs> do, 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 do. What's up, Juan? This is an Xbox 360. <laughs> Definitely not Xbox 360. My Xbox 360 would probably explode if it tried to run this game. Oh yeah. Here we go, here we go. We got Expelliarmus, which is nice. Let me through. Nice, beautiful day. Does anybody know what season is supposed to be the first season in this game? I assume it's like a spring. It looks like spring to me, but... I just said it's a beautiful day out and then it starts raining. Of course. I like this little fountain. We have to go below where we are here. Find a way. Corridor. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming kindling. Uh huh. It turns fall next, uh, so it's so this is more like a spring summer type of thing. Okay, we won't get the winter time till later. Devil snare seems to thrive in darkness. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. I knew it. Oh shoot! Yeah, I knew it. The, the Lumos. Lumos. That's why we do this. We don't have to worry about Lumos. Lumos. Rebellion. There's a treasure over there. Huh. A nice new outfit, I think. Uh, no trait applied. Might be level seventeen to wear that. Number sixteen. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
Hey, welcome in, Lavelle. There he is. I need to light up more torches here. Freaking plants don't get me. Whoops. Lumos. Seems the devil slayer was protecting a chest of some kind. We'll get up there. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. That was high top. Shoot. It would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. It's huge. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. 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 I just I don't think I just walk up and get it, do I? Incendio. Oh, okay, I thought the thing was like, gonna try to eat me. Or something. You're on 39. All right, you got this. You got this. Okay, you almost there. A nice little trip. Okay. Don't mind if I do steal everything in here. I don't think we've been in the greenhouse before, have we? No. Maybe certain things only grow at certain times of the year too. Who knows? Collect what we can of that. Rebellion. Nobody's gonna suspect a thing. Sweet leaves, Titney leaves, Rebellion. His place is a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Oh, my gosh. Sweet leaves, fluxweed stems, not grass sprig. There's like a main mission right here. Dear Professor Garlic, how very thoughtful of you and to remember that strawberries are my favorite. They 
They're sweet as can be. It's no wonder muggles love them so much. Everything you cultivate seems to be of such high quality. From bitter root to berries, I do hope that my darling niece can learn this skill whilst under your tutelage. The Nora so adores you, as do all of your students, I'm sure. Warmest regards always, Eleanor Everlay. I think Eleanor's crushing in on the herbologist. Blue flame, nice. Yeah, we've not been over here yet. This is cool. This is so nice. I like chill in this room all day. Whoa, that's a lot deeper than I thought it was. <laughs> Didn't bring my swimmies. Secret down here, see? Oh, cool. You can see it growing under the water, the roots of it. Rebellion. Oh. We got a nice treasure. Scooby snack, nice. Another bite of this glorious cookie. Thank you. Welcome back, Dave. You guys have 99 steel, 97 per, uh, percentage for perimeter defense. This is in crazy defense. Ain't no boy scoring on him out there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's Scooby Snack in about an hour. Do they, do they like? There's like a cool down period sometimes. Somebody said they were like out of hydrations the other day. Like what? Let's look at that. Have you found anything to? Uh, Prove my brain. Change yet. settings on there. Hello, Duncan. I have the proof you wanted. That's one leaf. Hob house. It must have been a giant venomous tentacular. It's even more than I expected. Oh, damn. I knew you were the one to ask. I appreciate you getting it for me. Here. Of course. I hope this helps you prove yourself. This is sure to put an end to puff scheme dunking for good when I show everyone in the common room tonight. This will show ever how ridiculous that nickname was. Thank you again. So we're always seem to be and doing helping again. students with their... I know I will. ...that are being, like, bullied, like... Thank you for all of your help. No more puff scheme dunking for me. Okay, that one's done. Alright, we did a few missions. We can do some exploring, I think, now. We have on the uh, well. There's a 
challenges, quests, say the assignment, got another one of those. I don't think I'm going to do anything main right now. foggy there's another scooby snack oh there we go <laughs> he's like I got you guys gonna make me finish this cookie huh which is like the only scooby snack I have here right now that's why but hey we'll get it done mm. thank you I'll have some water for the hydration. I have some water now. There we go. Adventure. We should probably just flu flame out of here. I'll show this Hogwarts. Uh, Demi guys statues uh, astronomy tables zero one I'm gonna go back to the library annex. Because there's going to be well, that's kind of that's where we are, anyways. Um, for now, see if we can find more chests or something. Have all those chests with the eyes now? We can like get all those. Adventure, are we? Been to the restricted area. There might not be anything else in here. Oh, there's this. Oh, yeah, we don't. We still don't know how to get rid of this flame. Here. So there's gonna be like a lot of like stuff still to find around here. Stuff above us. Yeah. Rebellion. Have to get up higher, I think. The ding means there's a page in the far way. That ding there. That always means that there is one. Huh. 
I didn't know that. That's good information, Dave. I thought I just did it automatically every time. I guess the uh, closer we are, the louder it'll be. See one in here. Maybe it's above us there. Now look for areas that you think would have pages too. Well, that's a much louder here. There it is. Yeah. Portrait of Sir Cadogan. Sir Cadogan was allegedly friends with Merlin himself, and as such became a sworn knight of the Round Table. Although he's only really known to the wizarding world, um, he is famous for his def uh, defeat of the Wyvern of Y, and now spends his days challenging students to duels. All right, let's keep going up here. Yeah, okay, so there isn't a ding now. Okay, I didn't even notice that before. I always automatically thought it did it. That's cool. How do we get up higher here? There's like... There's chests over there. How do we get to that? Like a secret door or something, is there? Oh well. Let's go over here. Go up even higher. Is this where like the trophy room was? Spell activated. Hang on. Page somewhere. I think it's over here. Yep. Oh, this wicked witch. Honeyduke's passageway. Uh, hidden behind the statue of a one-eyed witch is a secret passageway from Hogwarts to the cellar at Honeyduke's. It can only be accessed using a particular charm. One that we probably don't have. Lumos. Rebellion. Hmm. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'd most pleased to be included. Here. Where's the other Rebellion. Are we just doing one? No, so that one is
to do these now. Four. So if it's going to be six, then that would be zero. So it's, it would be this this owl thing, whatever it is, and then. Six, we need a five, right? One, two, three, four, five. It'd be like the crab looking thing. If we can find the okay. other the other part of this. I don't know where it is. Where's the other one locked to this? Here. The Hogwarts architect, uh, shown here, is journal by the four uh, house mascots, designed and oversaw the construction of Hogwarts Castle alongside founder Rowena Ravenclaw, who is credited with creating this ever-changing floor plan. Look at that, the architects behind it all. House point hourglasses. These large ornate hourglasses containing rubies, diamonds, sapphires, and emeralds are enchanted to keep count of house points for Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, and Slytherin, respectively. And these are the house point balls. That's cool. Rebellion. Still have to find the other thing that's linked to that. Like. Oh, let me get this one. I've always said that travel hardens the mind. Maybe it's this one. Yeah. Ooh. Find another one of those flying keys. There's one of these here. Still another page in here. Oh, wait, wait. There's some stuff in here. Where's he taking me? Oh, he's toying with me, this one. Gotcha. Oh, this, this is cool right here. Look at that. That Draco. Not the Draco. Hogwarts crest. The Hogwarts coat of arms includes a lion, snake, eagle, and badger representing each of the four houses, along with the school motto, Draco Dormiens Nunquam Titiliandos, which means never tickle a sleeping dragon. Never do it. Well, thanks, Dave. Never, yeah, never tickle a sleeping dragon. Never do it. It's just... You'll regret it. There's still another key somewhere around here flying around. Off on another adventure, are we? Another 
a AJ somewhere. Over here somewhere. House Elf Recipe Book, rumored to contain some of Helga Hufflepuff's original creations. This book holds a collection of Hogwarts students' favorite recipes over the centuries. Some dishes, like pickled dirigible plums, are likely an acquired taste. Well, he seems to enjoy it all. So, I was probably going to take a break soon, guys. I haven't. I haven't taken a break yet tonight anyway. I'm gonna stretch out a bit. <sighs> um, I'm in the wine cellar now. Very pagey over here. There it is. Pear portrait. If one tickles the pear in this still life painting of a bowl of fruit, it will giggle before turning to a doorknob to allow the entry to Hogwarts kitchen. Tickle, huh? Tickle, you say? I don't have any tickling spells. I don't think any of these would really work on it, huh? If I don't remember that's there, then like I'll never come back down here and get it. Oh shoot. Okay. Rebellion. Another page. Hufflepuff barrels. To enter the Hufflepuff common room, one must tap the barrel two from the bottom. Middle of the second row on the rhythm of Hufflepuff. An errant tap will result in being denied access and doused in vinegar. Must tap the barrel two in the bottom middle of the second row. <laughs> Coming in? Are you playing Fortnite? No, you're not? No? What's going on? Hmm. Winning. We're looking at the, uh, the barrels. Jesse has joined us here. Here, let me move this these games right here. Come on in. Oh. I thought you were playing Fortnite out there. How far did your brother get in the uh, Last of Us thing? Not too far? No. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, you can play. You have your Switch with you. <laughs> Break time soon. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Alright, so if we. Tap this one. I don't know what it means by tap. That one, right? Well, I broke one. I think I can get in there anyways. Nope. Not sure what to do with that. Maybe there is a way there, I don't know. Let's go. Still another key somewhere. I thought I heard one actually. Come to think of it, did I hear one down here? Just have to listen for those little keys lying around. That noise. Maybe not. You would see it with the Revelia. 
Business, Ignithia. To keep the valley on. We'll just keep going wherever it takes us here. At this point. Is this another new area that we have not seen? Yes, it is. Lower Grand Staircase. Oh, gear slots are full. Hang on. Let's find... Um, let's get rid of something. We'll destroy a couple of these. We're almost level 17. Wear that one. Oh, it's a legendary outfit. Elegant blazer. Nice to see you, my young friend. Chest behind here. The witch's bed. Where's um, Moaning Myrtle? Oh. Is there ever going to be anything in like one of these bathrooms? What about the ch uh, Chamber of Secrets? Yes, I love these. Let's do this. All right. Um, I need. Which one is it? What spell? I think it's the light one, right? So I'll do that, and then I'll put. Right up there. All right, so we need to look for this area. That's like such a. That's a really vague one. That could be any hallway here. Could look at that one. The secrets of the Hufflepuff barrels. Yeah, we're gonna. We're, I don't. We haven't figured that one out yet. I'm not really sure what to do with that. It's gonna be one of these hallways here. I can hear it. Look like this. Okay. There it is. Whoops. Oh. oh, that was not the right. Oh, what did I do with it? Slytherin sink uh, scratched in to one of the copper taps on the seemingly ordinary sink is the girl's toilet is a small snake no one knows what it means we have legendary gear here there we go a newt Take a break in a minute, guys. 
Come back and play a little more of this tonight for sure. Really loving this game so much. It is just. Thank you everyone for joining me too. Secrets of Slytherin holes. There's secrets everywhere here. That we aren't sure how to how to deal with. Some new gloves. Rebellion. And it's like, like I said, you could just play and play and play inside this, inside Hogwarts, just finding all secret rooms and stuff, not even going outside. There's just, there's so much. These are all locked now. There's a page inside there, I think. Can't get over there. This is like a Slytherin area. You can tell. Alright, let's go. Let's go up here. There's a snake on the top of the faucet, you said? Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. Wait, what is this door? Can't get through there yet. It was this one. They said there was one over like a snake thing, but I don't see any. Don't see it. Rebellion. But there are snake things everywhere here, but just not. Hey, didn't they say there was like a somebody put a snake? Maybe it was the other bathroom. Pretty sure it was that one, but maybe they just said they did. Yeah, it must have just been, you're right, it's probably just an Easter egg then, I guess, yeah. Maybe they didn't actually put it on here. Was that in one of the movies, Jesse? Uh, somebody putting a snake on one of the faucets in the Slytherin bathroom? No, I don't remember. I don't remember. Hmm. Rebellion. Probably just some little Easter egg thing from the pagey. Interesting. Now we are back here. Yeah, all these locked doors, man. Around. Student leaves pulling out like a top hat. Whoa, where are you off to? Are you alright? Look like you've seen a ghost. Yeah, finally. What the heck? Get away! What the oh, heck yeah. is going on? <laughs> from the restricted section. Yes, I mean, shut up. Get up. Hey, <laughs> perhaps you'll find sweeping the courtyard more productive. That's funny, like, oh, just like some random thing that just occurs in the game that, by chance. That is what I said. And let this be a lesson. That's how lively the world is. And things just happen around you. Ugh, <laughs> feel like a muggle. I got a look at one of them. Saw something about the Cruciatus Cat. I 
Cruciatus. Ah, oh, look at this. Yeah, we have not been to this area yet. Whoa, that person's just like walking on the side. Is that supposed to be happening? Or is that a glitch? It does look like it's supposed to yeah, because they're using like magic. They're trying to like balance themselves on there. Jesse wants to start a uh, playthrough and make Draco. Mm. <laughs> Do you want to play? You want to play? You can play for a bit if you want. You sure? You sure you don't want to play? Mm. You run around, run around for a while, explore. I know you want to start your own game too, but. Man, there's so much beauty to see in this game. Rebellion. It's magic. <laughs> I'm walking on the side. Because <laughs> I said, we found that funny glitch before where we like fell through. I'm like, well, maybe this is another funny glitch. I want to learn that spell, the one where I can walk up walls. This is like around the area where we fell through too, I think. Again. We, right? Yeah, this is it. Huh. Ended up back here that connected or anything. Alright, I'm going to take a break. When we come back, we'll go on a little more exploring adventure and See what else we can do. We found a lot of pages tonight. A couple of side quest things. So I shall return in just a few. Thanks for hanging out, everybody. Really appreciate it. Is she going to stream her playthrough of Hogwarts Legacy? I don't know if she will. They're asking if you're going to stream. She was streaming, um, what was it? Little Nightmares the other night. We were, me and her brother were there. I know that was fun. She doesn't stream a lot, but. Um, but if she if she does play it, maybe she'll maybe she'll stream some of it. I don't know. It's up to her if you want to stream it. See, the viewers they want to see you rather than me. I tell you, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Nobody wants to watch me stream. <laughs> All right, I'll be back in a few. Oh, yeah, I think all I have is this cookie right now, so I'll just go with that the Scooby snack for the moment. Um, we'll be back, guys. Thank you for hanging out. Thanks for watching. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves. More Hogwarts to come after the break.
are back. Gonna play this for a little bit longer tonight. Uh, thanks to the Lurk, Arachna. Everybody, thank you, Dave. Thank you so much. Everybody's doing okay. All right. Let us see. Well, that's legendary gear there. I'm gonna get rid of these ones. Level 18. Um, challenges. We have like a bunch of rewards here. We have that many rewards to claim, okay. Dark art wizard, so yeah, just like fighting a certain amount of each enemy is like part of the part of like unlocking more stuff too. Try to hop on a little bit earlier tomorrow um, for stream. Doing a lot of late night streams lately, but maybe tomorrow I'll try to get on <laughs> a tad bit earlier. Which we'll do. Um, Is that one of those things? Little dragonfly guys. Bring me to your leader. Here we go. We got good at slapping. Another house token. Um. Damn, we have a lot of house tokens. Maybe we should go return these. Hang on, let's go return our house tokens. The ones that we've collected. And we've done it. So if we go... I don't even remember where our... Hogwarts South... Where is our tower? Um... Where is where, where is our common room? I'm trying to find, is it like, whoops. Didn't want to do that. I'm trying to find like where that is. Uh, is it like the grand staircase? Trophy room. Ravenclaw, there we go. Return those that we have. Another house token for the house chest. We got plenty more. Can't wait to see what we get in here if we get all these. I'm making good progress with those tokens. Making really good progress. About half of them now. Spend some time in our common room. Hmm. lively day here. Hey, hey, hey. Why can't we get by there? How dare they? They know who I am.
Hey, you, you littered there. That's a big idea. I throw it in the trash? Did I do it? Freaking janitor now? Oh, this room is awesome. I don't think we've been in this room yet. Have we? It's a locked chest. It's locked. Maybe we have. There's the chessboard. Oh yeah, I think we actually have. I remember that. Piano and stuff. Should be where we. Oh wait, no. It's locked as well. Rebellion. Here's the dormitories. These are where we get up every day. in here handy resource indeed your little guide and most pleased to be included Maybe that was ours. Rebellion. Oh, these are nicer bathrooms than we've seen. Private tubs. Look at these great details in this. It's just, just all over every place you go. This looks awesome. And that's locked as well. All right, let's head out back on the map again. Where should we go? I think we should go. Um, There. Sink. <laughs> there, right there. Okay. A couple of adventure. I don't think it'll be um, too much longer of a stream tonight, guys. I'm gonna try to. I'm really tired. I didn't get much sleep last night, so. I've been. So I want to try to hop on earlier tomorrow. I do want to go out to the world map here. Oh, thanks, Dave. For this. I want to go. I want to make sure it's still over here. Um.
I want to go back over here. We don't have any flu flames over there, do we? There's got to be one in town there. Right? A little bog town, man. I'll have another sip of the coffee here, the hydration. Just a little bit more energy. So tomorrow we might work on more, potentially maybe some more X-Men Legends too. Off on another adventure, are we? Took the long way over there just to see what we might come across to. Talk to the goblin outside Lower Hogsfield. Was it goblin? Anything else around here? Yes. Dun, dun. Here we go this way. It's easy to get lost in freaking Hogwarts uh, school here, though, I'll tell you that. It's so big. So many rooms. But at least, like, certain areas have, like, a, more of, like, a distinct... Rebellion. Kind of structure to them as well. There's a guy. Flattened armor. Uh, this set of armor belonged to Sir Skagglethorpe, the headless who unwisely challenged a mountain troll to the game of musical chairs. Well, brave. Very brave, Arlen. What are you up to now? There's another page somewhere. Might be behind that door there. I oh, know, it sounds like it's closer. There it is. Scorch marks. Allegedly the location of the first known instance of an arguably successful casting of Bombarda, the unknown caster unidentifiable. <laughs> Cool. Whoa. The page is right here, I think. Frog choir. Here perch the slimy yet symphonic frogs that comp uh, comprise the Hogwarts frog choir. These magical amphibians can sing in six part harmony and hold a pitch better than most humans. Oh, do they want to start a band? I want to hear them sing. Rebellion. Oh, 
we've gone way off the course here, huh? This is awesome. I like music. Huh? <laughs> You're not saying Budweiser? Let's head down towards the other thing, unless we find like the fly that goes to this. Another locked chest. This is another area we've not been at all. There's a page here, huh? Look out. These too. Goodness me, there's. Oh, here we go. I already know where you're gonna lead me. Did he make it up there? Brilliant, Newt's commander. Rebellion. I think that hall is where this butterfly is going to be. Page in here somewhere. Well, Merlin, it says on the stained glass window. Uh, History of magic windows. This set of stained glass windows features Merlin, the four Hogwarts founders, various other witches and wizards of the ages. We can get a better look at all this. Cool. I look at that butterfly. <sighs> we can't find it right now, it's it's fine. I'm kinda lost where I am now. Came back around here, huh? Rebellion. Another one of those chests. Urn of Ashes. This particular urn is rumored to have once borne the inscription. Pioneer and Dragon Taming should not have started with the Hungarian horn tail. This is cool down here. All right, we're gonna we will come back to all these areas. Rebellion. Where was that? See now I'm like lost. Is it up here? Limbus. Whoa. <laughs> It's like this, like this Egyptian looking uh, statue here. Plant by the window. It could be like behind a locked door for all I know. Over here. Let's 
go look this way. And maybe it's through here. Level one lock. I mean, I probably should have the level one lock already, huh? I'll be weak. It's not up here, is it? Should be relatively easy to kind of spot. Yeah, I don't see it anywhere. It might be behind one of these locked doors. Just maybe. Oh, it's like over this way. Guess not. Yeah, it's probably behind something that's locked. We will, um... Let's, let's start heading back to where we were going originally. I want to get to this bog town. We'll probably end like around there. <sighs> Upper Hogsfield. Are these people here? And again, always looking around for more stuff. Just too much to see. <laughs> oh wait, that's the wrong way. Go through here. Been through there. So we'll do some missions from there. I think there's a main mission with Natty down there too. That we can do next time. straight road of where to go here. Back outside in the beautiful world of this game. Couple chests in there. Let's see if we get to maybe we can fight a few enemies on the way too. Uh, this gameplay <laughs> throughout this series I said it's gonna be definitely a sweet sweet long playthrough not gonna be rushing through anything do missions here and there soak up everything have we been over here oh this is the other side okay look at the sights here I mean, the fact that we have the room of requirement, there's beasts, herbology, we haven't even done any of those, any of that stuff yet. And we don't even have room either. There's like a lot of stuff we haven't even tapped into and tons and tons of spells that we still haven't even learned. Keep evolving quite nicely here. Can we go in here? I don't remember. Oh yeah. Nothing else in here, is there? It's like the seasons that change. 
<laughs> yeah, so good. And this is the bog town. So there's like a couple side missions here. Um, and then there's like a main mission with Natty who's been patiently waiting for days and days over there for us to come talk to her. I like this little town. There's a troll. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Arn. Is it about the ones that sure the shopkeeper told us about? Like we should probably sell maybe some stuff too that we don't Hello, want. Hello, Mr. Sammy. What can I do for you? Let's go see Sammy. Uh... What do you have for sale? It's our favorite shopkeeper. What can I help you with today? Uh... I'll sell this mask. <laughs> Buy. I'm gonna buy one of these Maxima potions. Ah yes, a wonderful choice. And uh, potion. And a couple more Wigan Well. We'll just keep stocking up on Wigan Well. See you again sometime. Oh, there's some enemies over here. So I don't think we can do any more missions tonight because I'm going to end pretty shortly. Just want to do some more fighting here. Spiders, of course. What's with the, all the yellow dots are there for the... Anything else? What was that? Did you pull on the... Uh, oh, the, uh, the, the curtain. There's the curtain. <laughs> it's like, what is that noise? The curtain got pulled. There we go. Boom. Uh, we have Expelliarmus as well now. Oh, oh there's a treasure. Underneath over there. Can we get this? Cool. Basket weave. I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. Oh, Nellie's probably gone. Oh, she'll place. be gone soon, I think. She's probably only here. Spiders, looks like you're no longer getting this game. <laughs> Arachnid. Yeah, there's uh, there's some nasty ones here in this one. There's always spiders in every game, I feel like. Every game I play now has spiders. I'm just kind of accepting the fact that I'm going to have to deal with them wherever I go. I think you could turn off the the spiders though, honestly. Like if they really if they like bother you really bad. I think there's an arachnophobia. But hang on, let me let me make sure. I, I want to say there there is. It's gameplay. Uh, camera shake. 
High contrast, menu reader. Maybe not, maybe I lied. Maybe I lied. I guess there isn't. I guess we just have to deal with our fears. I'm just not seeing it. Maybe not, never mind. <laughs> yeah, I lied apparently. I thought that's what I heard that they were doing. Like, I know I saw like an article, it was like, oh arachnophobia mode or something where you like turn off I guess not. Maybe it's like, was it an option when I started my game? Maybe? I don't know. Just expel the almost all of them. You're fine. You'll be alright. Right? I guess there isn't. Oh my gosh. Because I know there's going to be like bigger spiders in the game too than the ones I'm already fighting, and that's going to upset me. <laughs> There's a mod on PC. Too bad you hate PC. <laughs> yeah, I figured somebody would make something. I wonder if like the developers will update the game with that, though. Yeah, apparently there's going to be multiplayer, I heard, as well. Which, I'm not sure how that's going to work. Is it just going to be like, you can enter each other's game and just like go on missions together? Or just like go out in the world and explore, maybe? Like fighting things? I mean, that would be cool. Like there's no like... Maybe you could play some of the mini games against each other. I guess there's like some co-op stuff you could do that would be really fun. I don't know. Oh, before we go off on the rest... I said that's not I'm not hundred percent sure on that though. That's what I've heard. It's like a place right out of a storybook. The game is satisfactory has a mode where the spider enemies Oh, and the cats you guys are saying. Oh what the heck? So there's a satisfactory mode? So it is a thing. Whatever that is. High contrast. I guess it's not on here yet. Maybe that's only on the PC, huh? Still. <laughs> Oh, the game, oh, you said the game Satisfactory. Oh my gosh, I thought there was like, there was a mode called Satisfactory mode on this. Oh my gosh. There's a game called Satisfactory where you can turn spiders into cats, basically. That's funny. No, no I'm just stupid. I'm just like, what? I thought we were still talking about Hogwarts. Like, uh, I'm surprised there isn't, hang on, like there's no flu flames over here, that seems really odd, because every time I come over here I have to like, physically walk over here, like, it seems 
Hard to believe there's no flu flame here. Because they're like everywhere else. Especially when there's like missions to be had here. Maybe there's one I just haven't spotted. Oh, there is one. What the heck? It's like hidden on the map behind it. Yeah, it's hidden behind there. Oh, there it is, yeah. It was like hidden behind the uh, the mission oh, stuff. I was like, I know there's got to be one. Lumos. Hi ho, hi ho. Yeah, so thanks, Dave. I was like, wait a minute, why is there not one here? It wasn't showing up on the map just because like the uh, main mission icon was so much bigger <laughs> that it was hiding it. I'm like, what the heck? You get conflicted when you hear all the meows in that satisfactory game because you know that they're really spiders just posing as cats. Hello, friend. All right. Well, um, so what's tomorrow? Tomorrow's Wednesday, right? So yeah, we should do wrestling Wednesday. I'm in, I'm in the mood for more wrestling games again. Alrighty, so we'll definitely do some wrestling stuff tomorrow to start off. Then maybe we'll switch to another game later. Um, yeah, wrestling Wednesday tomorrow. Yes, 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 yes. Becoming one of my favorite days of the week. Um, do that, and then maybe we'll, maybe we'll do some more X Men Legends too tomorrow, or maybe more of this afterwards. On, we will talk to you next episode. We will find out what you need, and perhaps Nati as well, who has gone home for the evening. Nice to see you, my young friend. And then there's like a mission out here too on the docks. We'll do some missions around here. Get some more story on. Grace Pinch Smedley. She's just like so lonesome out here. Thank you. Yes, the wrestling one's still there. <laughs> the other horrors of the game, I know. But thank you. Thank you for stopping in again. Thank you so much. Um, I'm, I'm going to be ending anyway, so you don't even have to worry about more horrors tonight. Um, I really appreciate everybody that, that stopped in tonight during the stream. Hope everybody enjoyed uh, the game in tonight. Another episode of this as well for Twitch and YouTube. You all are amazing for the support and just hanging out. Um, yeah, we'll be doing missions here when we come back to this. As always, we'll be playing this pretty heavy rotation for a little while until we want to take a break from it I never thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this but I absolutely far. love this game so much um what have we got about 1230 alright but yeah guys I should be on tomorrow at some point maybe a little earlier hopefully a little bit longer of a stream too um but I appreciate you all take care everybody and be safe Enjoy your gaming as well out there. Let me save this and uh, till next time, everybody. Zero is the number. Cheers, everybody.